Those stories and more in just moments, but first we start with some breaking news in central Phoenix tonight near 12th Street and McDowell. Phoenix officers shoot and kill a man while responding to a burglary call. That scene unfolding just hours ago in that part of town. Good evening, everyone. I'm Jonathan McCall. In just the last five minutes or so, Phoenix police giving us an update on that investigation. 12 News journalist Gabriella Becerra live tonight on scene. Gabby, what do you know? Well, Jonathan, those Phoenix police spokespersons tell us that this all started as an online transaction that turned violent. Take a look behind me, a very large police scene right in front of an alley where that sale was taking place. Police tell us that a man was trying to sell a motorcycle online. They agreed to meet in this alley, and shortly later they called in, in as an armed robbery taking place. When police showed up, that suspect was on the motorcycle and raised a gun at the officers. The police, we are told two officers shot at the man. He was taken to the hospital where he later died from those injuries. Now at this time, that's pretty much all police say they can share with us about who that suspect is. But this happened in a neighborhood, as you can tell, and very close by is a park where people were playing and watching baseball all afternoon. They tell us they heard several gunshots. What did it sound like? Jump, 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 jump. Really fast. Fast. Wow. It's, I think it was more than a gun pistol. Wow. It was something else, something big. No officers were injured, and none of the people that were a part of that motorcycle sale, except for the suspect, was injured as well. But we've been talking to people who were kind of shaken up by this shooting happening. We're continuing to speak with them, and we'll bring you more details live tonight on Channel 12 at 10. For now, reporting live in Phoenix, Gabriela Becerra, 12 News. Gabby, thanks so much.